as a ski resort, Whistler's reputation precedes it. And in my humble, humble opinion, it, uh, it more than deserves it. With over 8,000 acres of skiable domain, over 200 marked runs, it gets over 10 meters of uh, annual snowfall. This place is huge. It's two massive mountains, Whistler behind me, Black home in that direction, uh, also linked by the peak to peak gondola. It's 4.4 kilometers long, and if the mood takes you, you can switch mountains in just 11 minutes. It's incredible, I tell you. One of the best things about skiing here in Canada is also the lift system. It runs so smoothly. All the lifties are super, super friendly, but also if a queue develops, they make sure that every single chair and every bubble is filled to capacity. It's all about getting us up on the hill to ski more. I love Whistler because the nightlife is awesome, snowboarding's awesome, and the people are even better. For me, the best thing about being in Whistler is waking up to a foot of powder nearly every single morning. Come and get some. 25 minutes might seem like a long time to get to the top of the mountain, but once you're up there, it is so, so worth it. The ride takes you to a magical, magical place where the skiing is just beautiful. Whatever your level here, you are well catered for. They've got a fantastic, fantastic ski school. Um, they've got some great beginner only areas, lots of, uh, lots of people out on the mountain making sure that people are behaving and not kind of skiing full tilt through them. But then if you want to progress, you've got like a, woohoo, nice. You've got beautiful groom runs, get your speed up, everything up to double diamond runs, huge mobile fields, and of course, huge open bowl terrain. If you want to go out there and find deep, deep powder, some steep and deep kind of runs, drop-offs, cliffs, it is here and you can do it. You can let your mind run wild. If you want to try it, no one pretty much is going to stop you. It's phenomenal.